And for our final part for this video, I'm going to create a brick that vanishes whenever you walk on it. So we can start by inserting in another new part into the workspace. And what we're going to do for this part is also insert in a new script. So this script is going to be a little bit more complex because we're going to have to start by setting local tween service equal to game colon get service tween service. And once we have our tween service, we can copy the same script.parent.touched colon connect function and also set our check part as our variable and we're going to need to do the same thing where we check local humanoid equals check part dot parent colon find first child humanoid and just like last time we're going to need to check if humanoid doesn't equal nil we can set tween service colon create for our instance we're going to set script dot parent for our tween info we can set tween info dot new and just simply put in one or two or however many seconds you want it to fade in and out for. And then after our tween info, we can put a new open brace and first put transparency equal to one and then comma can collide equals false. And then at the end of this, we can put colon play. Now, after we make our tween, we can set task.wait and put our delay time. I'm just gonna put five seconds. But after that, we can just copy this tween right here press control C to copy it and control V down here to paste it in. Now I'm just going to change the transparency equal to zero and the can collide equal to true. So what we're first going to need to do is under our tween service, we can set local debounce equal to false. When we check for our humanoid, we can check if humanoid doesn't equal nil and debounce equals equals false then. So if it's not currently fading out, we can first set debounce equal to true and then at the very bottom right under our last tween we can set task.wait1 or however long you set your tween to and then after that we can set debounce equal to false and just like that we have a new cooldown system so that this won't run again after it's already fading out 